I think what else is going to prepare us is we have to have an election readiness strategy. And I, I do have one. It, it consists of five components. In the back of the room, you'll find a, a newspaper called the West Coast Conservative, which I publish as part of my campaign. You'll find that strategy outlined in there and much of what I'm talking about here. That strategy involves, the first off is we have to have 85 candidates and 85 writings. Every British Columbian deserves the right to vote conservative. And we've got to give them that. It's not sufficient to run 56 candidates. It's more than we'd ever run in a generation, no doubt. And it was a tremendous feat, and I applaud every candidate who ran, because I think it, it was hard. It was a steep learning curve. But we must be better prepared the next go around. 85 candidates, 85 writings, and a year in advance. Let's get this thing done. In addition to the 85 candidates, in order to prove to the people of British Columbia that we can govern ourselves, we need to create a candidate caucus and a shadow government. And then we need to use the talents and skills from these candidates in order to prepare our, our own policies and platforms and respond to the things that are happening in British Columbia and of course articulate a vision for the future. So after that, we have to develop platform a year in advance of the election. We have to organize our constituency associations and make sure they're functioning properly, make sure that they also have the funding that they need to operate. And so we also have to be war chesting and and making sure that we have the money there when the time comes in order to pay for this. So being better prepared, being a better communicators, and being better organized is what it's going to take to lead this party into the 2017 election. Thank you.